Okay, we're just going to confirm that this Carlton remote control is paired with the uh, sump grinder unit. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to flip on the switch to remote control on. Um, we're going to come over here and we're going to turn on the key. At this point, um, we've got the uh, emergency button down. We're going to push this cutter head to the left. It's going to start to blink. We're going to turn this button clockwise. It's going to come up. At that point, this button just popped out. Um, when that button's out, that's a good sign. What, we're, what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold this button in and keep keep it held in and then I'm going to come over here and I'm going to start the unit up and then after it starts up then I can let go of the button. Notice if I let go right now the button comes out. So let me start this unit up real quick here. Okay, started it up. I let go of the button. So now it's uh, communicating this is what's going on with the blinking pattern. And if I do uh, cut her head down, it's starting to go down. So. so that's uh, what you need to do uh, when you're going to be connecting up and confirming that the remote control is operational. In this uh, example we didn't have to reprogram the remote control to the receiver which is inside of here because it was already pre-programmed. So helpful steps to, to know about when you're operating this uh, Carlton 7015 unit. Thanks. Please like, share, and subscribe.